Good morning. Hey, Buenos dias. Um, good. I should have been doing that on Friday, the day before Cinco de Mayo. Now we don't have to speak the lingo. The lingo. No, we can just say. We're hey, not damn. Hey, how are you? How are you? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm advertising my favorite video channel. CMB. My favorite video channel I have to give is the Country Network. C. N. Country Network. Oh, maybe C N. Yes. T C N. The that's, Country Network. T C N. Yeah, that's where my um old boss works. No kidding. Yeah. Oh, uh, the dude from. Uh, the dude from Nashville. Carrie. Yes. This Carrie. is all irrelevant. You guys are like, who is this guy? Carrie, whose first name actually is Carrie, where everyone assumes my name is actually Carrie, when in fact it's not. It's Jim. Carrie. Actually, I think my name's Carrie. Yeah, that's true. I'm Cash. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, hey, Cash, how you doing? I'm like, she's not here. <laughs> I don't know how she's doing. You want me to call her? Four or five times yeah. yelling at, hey, Cash! I finally turn around. It's not me, dude. It's not me. Sorry. Welcome to Show Before the Show. Welcome. Take your shoes off. <laughs> we just got new carpet. Not really. Not really. Did you see the, the picture of the people who fell into the water during their prom? See, that's messed up. What happened in that story? All right, so here's the, this, this, and, and uh, I saw this yesterday, and I just loved it. They were actually, it started out like this. They were going to their junior prom, and they're all standing on. Oh, the, this is a prom. I all, thought you said wedding. Oh, I did say wedding earlier. It's, it's actually a prom. And uh, they're all dressed up going to the prom. Oh, and my gosh. They wanted to get as many couples there on the wooden pier as they could. That's up in uh, Wisconsin. And they took that picture, and the next thing you know, that occurred. Oh my god. And gosh. the pier came out beneath them and they all fell in. Those poor girls. The guys would get up, can get over it, okay? Yeah. yeah. But the girls, they spent hours getting ready. They were they they said they all weren't too upset. They all thought it was kind of funny and hair dryers and a couple of bit of thread needles <sighs> to fix some things that might have been ripped and they were ready to go in time for the show. I mean, can and some hairspray? Hair? And some hairspray. Yeah. But you know, I think there's a point though when after you've fallen into the water on a pier with all your friends, because let's face it, that would be people, kind of fun. Only people these people cared about were those people, right? You know, they didn't care about anyone else in high school. That's true. I'm sure. I mean, these were their friends. And who are you gonna hang out with? You're gonna hang out with those people, right? So, so if you're gonna look bad, all one of y'all is gonna look bad. All y'all gonna look bad. That's yeah, like whatever. Let's try to make ourselves look as good as we can. And if you've got a little seaweed in your hair, a little moss, seaweed, on your nose, that's okay. ain't no thing. That's just like decoration, we'll like a barrette. Past it. We'll look past it. Yeah, I, might I think everyone has a bad. Something about a dance story. My uh, from my high date, school. My date. This guy here's like saying, but my date. He'll always remember that she smelled kind of fishy at the dance. <laughs> I don't know why. It's kind of fishy. Really? Yeah. Polly was mine. Polly. Polly Paul, Pocket. Polly Pocket. Yeah. No, Polly. 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 She really dug me. That out. memorable, huh? Yeah, she really dug me. I didn't really dig her that much. She why worked. did you ask her? Because. Rhonda Sly was still dating someone, and I wanted to ask her, but Rhonda Sly was still dating someone, so I couldn't ask her because she was dating someone. So I, knew I couldn't Polly ask her. Would, I, uh, I knew Polly would go with me, so I asked her. and then two She days was later, a sure thing. Yeah, so two days later, Paul, uh, Rhonda broke up with her boyfriend, and I, I waited two days. You, why didn't you just say, tell... Um, oh, hey, Polly, I really don't yeah. want to go with you. I really didn't want to go with you. I'd rather go over here with her, but no, because I'm a good guy. I made a commitment. What am I going to do? She was all excited and happy. She didn't know I actually wanted to go with someone else. Well, now she does. Well, I don't think she really cares about it now. Because it's on the WWW. World Wide Web. Boom. 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 Right. The only thing bad happened to me was my nails broke before I got into the limo. If you'd been shellacked, you would have been okay. That's true. I had press and goes. Once, Please. You, once you go shellac, you don't go back, right? That's right. Isn't that what you say? <laughs> once you go shellac, you never go back. I'm Jessica from Sky to Fix. Hey, Jess. Yeah. I was going to end the show before the show. Okay. You're not, you don't want to do what's in your hand there? Uh, it's not that. You've been holding it in your hand. Well, the Monday after Mother's Day, I just found this interesting. Ashley Madison, the cheating website. Yeah. They say that that is the day that moms or wives cheat on their husbands. Are looking for someone else. Yeah. So I, I really just... should get my wife something really good for Mother's Day. Yeah. Basically the thing. Get your wife something that's good. Otherwise, she's going to be going to the website and looking for someone Exactly. Else. They say that the, the husband is thoughtless. Because he's thoughtless, I want to go somewhere else. Yeah. You know, in the end, you know who I blame here? Yourself. The wife, the mother, for being so self-centered. Or for you, for being thoughtless. Yeah, I can be as thoughtless as I want, but if you're so self-centered and says, if I don't get something, I'm going to go find me another man. Well, that's a little self-centered on your part. Not your part. It's very, the guy should have done something, but she's a little self-centered. I'm just saying, once you make that commitment, you shouldn't be cheating. No. But isn't that interesting that, that the day after Mother's Day that it is so many? That is very interesting. It kind of makes sense. Or the day after, like, Valentine's Day. I, you just dump them on Valentine's. Just dump them. Like, on the if day. You're going to cheat. Just dump them. Seriously. Have you ever broke up with someone on the day of something important? That blows. Have you ever done that? Uh, no. 
No. Me neither. That's me. Me neither. And I never have been dumped because they want the gift that I'm getting them. And then they dump me. But you're saying never been dumped ever. Oh, I've dumped every time I've been dumped. Oh, that's sad. I have a sad life. That's the show before the show and a whole lot more with Natalie's big lip. Bird's gonna land on that lip. And so I tell my kids the bird's gonna land there. So they could go like this. I would be like this all the time then. Well, here comes the bird. Here comes the bird. Where's it whistling? Okay, this is nonsense now. Okay, that's the show before the show.